Fading Currents Music, Film, Art and Comedy Festival kicks off tonight. TV6's Haley Ryan joins us live from one of the venues with the preview of all the fun happening in the next few days. Haley, already sounds like the fun is starting up there too. Hi, Will. I'm at Schubert Park in Rock Island, and as you can hear behind me, a band has already started performing. There's multiple vendors, including Common Chord, the Quad City Symphony Orchestra, and Bent River Brewing Company. Um, this is the Arts and Cultural Festival celebration. This is all part of the Alternating Currents Festival, which goes through Sunday. Even though I'm here in Rock Island, this is happening all over the Quad Cities. Kyle Carter, the executive director of the Downtown Davenport Partnership, says the festival is unique because there aren't many festivals that put local and national talent on equal footing and include film, comedy, music, and visual arts. A lot of music festivals out there, a lot of film festivals, but there are very few that combine all of this stuff into one. And uh, I think that is really unusual, let alone the fact that we cross the river and are technically in three cities and two states and two counties. Well, at 10.30, but Carter says things get busy tomorrow and Saturday before closing out on Sunday with lots of film and wrestling in Rock Island. Coming up at 6, we'll take you back across the river for a live performance in Rock Island. Haley Ryan, TV6 News. Looking like a lot of fun out there, Haley. Thank you. And you can learn more about alternating currents by visiting our website, kwqc.com, or by watching QCL tomorrow.